Your Excellency, thank you so much for opening up your home and the State House of the Republic of Kenya for today's service. It is historic. I remember, as um, High Excellency Pastor Don has said on the 5th of May, we said it's the fifth day of the fifth month, and you are 55 years old. And we said five was the number of perfection. We said that we would get here. And indeed, God has brought us here. It's a historic day. I don't think this has ever happened before. And I know some people are wondering what is going on out there. We want to tell them. This is the highest altar in this country. We. The, the word of God tells us, because I've seen the online and whatnot, Romans 1.16, mm -hmm. we are not ashamed yeah. of the gospel of the Lord. Oh, yeah. Our national anthem starts with a prayer. Oh, yes. For many years, systematically, we've been told to be ashamed of God's word. Yes. We are not ashamed. Yes. And from this hill, mm -hmm. Arima will flow Amen. throughout our country. Your Excellency, thank you for leading us by example, for mentoring us young leaders to know the word of God. I have seen many of our colleagues here, and I'll just speak on their behalf, that there's a new dawn in our country. We move down this country. I thank our spiritual fathers who are here. I'm very happy to see uh, Joe Kyle. I'm sure you might not know, but my mother started in the ministry at uh, Deliverance Karyoko with J.B. Masinde and many others, many years ago, my late mom. And that is how I have grown. Because the Bible says, if you raise a child in the way of the Lord, they will not depart. So I know I'm to me, I'm going to talk to me, Rudy. Not to me, Roka. So it's such an honor. It's a, it's, a, it's a great honor to see you. Even as we went round, and thank you, mom, for, for your word as well. Even as we went around the city with the Gitonga Bishop, with all of them, Bishop Mwai. In fact, Your Excellency, when I got my certificate, in 20 minutes, I was at Bishop Mwai's church to give thanks to God. We kept saying that our vision for the city is drawn from Jeremiah 3 now, 9. That this city will give God renown and joy and glory. And others will tremble when they see what the Lord has done for his people, starting from Nairobi City County.